So my name is Bryce Hansen. Um, I've been coming to ST for probably two years now. Um, off and on the last year, uh, had a shoulder spout, a little injury here and there, but um, I'm back, get back after it. So, um, but uh, yeah, I came to ST back in 2000, shit man, 14, 15 now. And um, I, got, I reached out to Mark and Jim because I was doing powerlifting. Um, in the Paralympic world and I was like shit I want to be really competitive and get after it and so I was like what better not uh, better way to do is uh, go to super training which is right in the neck of my woods so yeah so I mean my lifts lift um, I only do bench only obviously a little deficient in some areas but uh, um, I just recently lost quite a bit of weight I lost about 50 pounds of body weight so I was up at 220 and I was lifting about uh, 402 raw. Um, I recently lost 50 pounds and now I'm benching 365 raw. Um, so that's what I've been doing. I just did Mark Bell's uh, Cal Expo powerlifting meet with the slingshot, which was an awesome event. I think we should do more of them, super fun. Um, and I hit, I think, 402 uh, for my third attempt. And then I came in a week later and hit 405. So the strengths there, I just gotta keep pushing it along. Definitely. Yeah, so um, my goals with benching or just bench only or powerlifting in general um, is I want to hit 405 raw again. I mean, the guys have been giving me shit, Marcus in particular, and Damon. I used to say Damon too. Uh, so I have to hit it now. I've been promising it for a couple of years now. Um, so I want to do the SPF in June or July whenever it comes up and uh, try to hit it then. So I got a, got a lot of work cut out for me. Um, also, on the flip side of the coin, since I did lose all this body weight from keto and all that crap, um, I'm thinking about doing a show possibly in the next four months or so, see how low I can get my body weight. Um, if I end up doing the show, great. If I don't, then, you know, no harm, no foul. So, it's kind of my goals right now. Busy year. So, so um, I've been in the fitness world for, I mean, since I can remember, both my parents um, both did bodybuilding growing up and stuff, so I've always been in fitness, and then I decided, you know, I want to join the Marine Corps for a challenge, and so I joined the Marine Corps back in 2012. Um, I did about two years, and then um, I got injured and had to be medically retired, and so what happened was, um, back in 2004, or, yeah, 2012, yeah, 12 or 13, I forget. I think it was 12. No, 13, sorry. Back in 13, I uh, got hit on my motorcycle um, and I had to get a rod put in my leg. Uh, mangled my leg up pretty bad, so I went into surgery for this rod to get put in my leg. And little did you know, they kind of messed up on a couple things. You know, I got compartment syndrome, which is where your body kind of compartmentalizes itself and shuts off blood flow to that region. So muscle dies and bad shit happens. And so I actually was in a coma for about 20 days while they tried figuring this out. And by the 20th day, I woke up without a leg. So it was pretty gnarly. I went to bed with a leg, woke up without a leg. So it's like a scary movie that went bad or something. I don't know, bad dream. But um, so what happened from there was you get kind of put in a unit at the, the hospital back, um, I was in San Diego, Balboa Hospital and you're still active duty and then you have about it takes anywhere from year to one year to two years to process out and then um, go on about your life as a veteran um, so it took me only a year to process out and now i've been um, out since 2014 um, living at large so um, i actually met casey shit i think a year ago at the old gym um, and great guy man i mean we we connected right when we met um, you know he's kind of in the same situation as i am you know don't tell him this, but I call him a paper cut because he's just below the knee. But 
No, but he's a great guy. I mean, he's the stuff he's already done for our community and every community with powerlifting is awesome. And you know, definitely uh, somebody kind of want to follow in the footsteps. Um, I just met him again. He got to come out. Um, what was that last? Friday, Thursday, he was out here. He's squatting crazy amount of weight, deadlifting. I mean, only weight I wish I could do, but um, uh, just a great guy all around, and uh, can't wait to see what he comes up with or does in the future. So, yeah. So, all right. So you could find me, myself, at uh, Facebook and Instagram. Um, so my Instagram is at Bryhands, B-R-Y-H-A-N-S, and then Facebook you could search Bryce Hansen. Um, yeah, so I'm trying to uh, push out more videos and more pictures um, of my lifting and my journey. So hopefully I could help you guys with your journey or whatever. Just, you know, that daily inspiration or, hey, you need to wake up in the morning and go to the gym. Or even just get out of bed, like something I could help with, you know. Anyone could do it. It's, anything's possible.